It seems the work is never done when it comes to construction around the Alamo City, and that means you drivers need to keep an eye out for closures. Traffic Authority Stephen Cavazos has a look at some of the projects around town and how you can avoid them. Drivers are on the move this March, but guess what? So we're tech stock crews, which is why we're going to see a lot of road closures out there this month. So let's talk about what's happening this week along Loop 1604 on the north central side of San Antonio. Electrical work. Now this begins Monday, March 6, and will take us all the way up until the end of the work week, Friday, March 10th. This does start at 9 in the morning and should wrap around 3 in the afternoon. What we will see out there are westbound to eastbound turnaround short-term full closures. I know that's a lot, but it'll be right there at Loop 1604 and Lock Hill Selma Road. We're not done yet. Let's go ahead and get a jump over here to Loop 410 on the west side of San Antonio where bridge work will actually take place. Now this also starts on Monday, March 6th and this will take us up to Wednesday, March 8th. Now this one is overnight. So 9 in the evening to 5 in the morning is when you will see full alternating closures of the main lanes in both directions right there at Valley High Drive. So watch out for crews there. One last jump over here to yep 281 north side of San Antonio. Intersection work will begin on Tuesday, March 7th and that will also take us up to the end of the work week on Friday, March 10th. This begins at 9 in the morning and should wrap hopefully around 3 in the afternoon. We will see various lane closures on the frontage roads right there at Boulevardy Road. But you can also scan this QR code that's now on the screen that gets you to our KSAT traffic page and there's a full list of all the current closures that are happening right now in and around this Alamo City. So know before you go. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.